the VA-111SHK VAL torpedo and its descendants are supercarvitating torpedoes developed by the Soviet Union. They are capable of speeds in excess of 200 knots. Design and Capabilities Design began in the 1960s when the NII-24 Research Institute was ordered to produce a new weapon capable of engaging nuclear submarines. The merger of the Institute and GSKB-47 created the Research Institute of Applied Hydromechanics, who continued with the design and production of the SHKVAL. Previously operational as early as 1977, the torpedo was announced as being deployed in the 1990s. The SHKVAL is intended as a countermeasure against torpedoes launched by undetected enemy submarines. The VA-111 is launched from 533mm torpedo tubes at 50 knots before its solid-fuel rocket ignites and propels it to speeds of 200 knots. Some reports indicate that speeds of 250 plus knots may be achieved, and that work on a 300-knot version was underway. This high speed is due to supercarvitation, whereby a gas bubble, which envelops the torpedo, is created by outward deflection of water by its specially shaped nose cone and the expansion of gases from its engine. This minimizes water contact with the torpedo, significantly reducing drag. Early designs may have relied solely on an inertial guidance system. The initial design was intended for nuclear warhead delivery. Later designs reportedly include terminal guidance and conventional warheads. The torpedo steers using four fins that skim the inner surface of the supercarvitation gas bubble. To change direction, the fin, S, on the inside of the desired turn are extended, and the opposing fins are retracted. Manufacture The torpedo is manufactured in Kyrgyzstan by a state-owned factory. In 2012 the Russian government asked for a 75% ownership of the factory in exchange for writing off massive Kyrgyz debt to Russia. Espionage In 2000, former U.S. naval intelligence officer and an alleged DIA spy Edmund Pope was held, tried, and convicted in Russia of espionage related to information he obtained about the SHKVAL weapon system. Russian President Vladimir Putin pardoned Pope in December 2000, allegedly on humanitarian grounds because he had bone cancer. Specifications There are at least three variants. VA 111 SHKVAL, a Euro original variant. GOLIS Autonomous Inertial Guidance. SHKVAL 2 inches current variant. Believed to have additional guidance systems, possibly via the use of vectored thrust, and with much longer range. A less capable version currently being exported to various Third World navies. The export version is referred to as SHKVAL E. Iran claimed it has created a version named Hoot. All current versions are believed to be fitted only with conventional explosive warheads, although the original design used a nuclear warhead. Length, 8.2 meters, diameter, 533 millimeters, weight, 2,700 kilograms, warhead weight, 210 kilograms, speed, launch speed, 50 knots, maximum speed, 200 knots or greater. Range, around 11 a Euro 15 km. Older versions only 7 km. See also, List of supercarvitating torpedoes. References. Bibliography, Palmer, Norman. Cold War Submarines, The Design and Construction of U.S. and Soviet Submarines. Dulles, Potomac Books. ISBN 978-1-57488-594-1. External links. FAS page on the VA-111 SHKVAL underwater rocket, Ashley, Stephen. Warp drive underwater. Scientific American. Retrieved September 15, 2009. Preview, Tyler, Patrick. Behind Spy Trial in Moscow. A Superfast Torpedo. The New York Times.